Uh, what advice would you give for someone struggling to keep high flame cannon stacks? Well, it's not really an issue of keeping flame cannon stacks. It's an issue of kiting melees. I mean, there's a million things to explain with kiting melees, but... You just try to trade one for one with their 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 mobility, right? Like, you don't want to trade two shimmer charges for one charge. Like, I'm just using warrior as an example because they have a lot of mobility. Like, if a warrior charges you or something, <clears throat> you know, you're, you'll use one shimmer charge, you put a slow on him. At this point, he'll probably, like, leap to you or use a second charge. And then since you'll run out of shimmers, if you just use another one, you want to alter this one and then shimmer away. Um, because he has a third option, like he has a leap, so he's gonna leap to you now, but you have this distance that you made on your altar now, so then you can alter back. Keep in mind, shimmer's off the global, so every time you're shimmering, you should be pairing it with a global, to like slowing them or rooting them. 